Jen, how are you doing? Well, I'm actually feeling really, really good today. Daryl was so nice to me last night. He took me out for dinner and he even bought me flowers. Ah, isn't he cute? Seriously, Nicole? Because I remember what you said last week that he was so horrible. Well, sometimes. But deep down, he's actually really, really amazing. Okay class, we have a new student enrolling here, so please be kind to him. James? Come in. Take a seat. James, I would prefer if you sit next to Chris, please. Chris? Excuse me. Hey, what's your name? I'm Christopher Wong, by the way. You can call me Chris. My name is James Chan. James Chan? So, you're Chinese? Yeah. But you don't look like Chinese. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry if I offended you. I didn't mean to, I was just, you know, I was just curious. So, did you miss orientation? Are you familiar around school? I mean, I can take you and, you know, give you a tour around school, after, you know, during break or anytime you want. Sure. All right, morning. Welcome to Visual Arts. Well, let's get started on the lesson. All right, class. That's it for now. Get ready for art class. Hey Daryl, do you want to go to art class together? Hey, what's up? Yeah, sure Nick. Hang out after class. I'm done. What's the plan later? So right there is the canteen. And I'll show you more over there. Come. So right here is the female toilet. And here's the male toilet. Alright? So far, any questions? No. I think it's time for us to go art class now because it's starting very soon. <laughs> hey, come on, I'll show you the way. Hey babe, what are you? Is that my journal? Yeah. Well, I was looking for it just now. Really? Because I found it on your desk, laying there. Oh my god, Daryl. I can't believe you stole my journal. You know what? Let me read for you something. Alex is a cute guy. Chris is a nice friend. When did you even write these? I didn't write those, Daryl. Jen was the one who wrote- LIAR! What is going on? Nothing ma'am. We were just playing around. Whatever it is, make sure to not be left for my class. Hmm. 
You know what? Let's just hit the class. Let's go. Alex. Alex. You've got company. I'm sorry to interrupt Alex. I just want to ask you if James and I could sit with you. Because I don't want Daryl to scare him away. Please, Alex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll just sit here. What are you doing here? Leave! Uh, not gonna, because this is a group assignment, so deal with it. At least someone pay attention to my instruction from last week. Okay class, you have 30 minutes. Work together and good luck. Chris and James, I would prefer if you guys join up with Daryl and Nicole. It's filled with this old theoretical... It's every day with you, isn't it? You start off at the day looking like microwave shit and all of a sudden you're grinning from ear to ear. Having a relapse? Uh, while I would love to hear an advice from the poor man who got abandoned by his schoolmates in Form 1. Oh, you thought I didn't know? There is spreads your sad pass constantly around, you know. Jen, Alex, stop talking or I'll move both of you to a separate group. <sighs> wow, look who's the popular kid now. Uh, you guys, uh, I need help, especially on this. Here we are. You speak? Yo, Daryl. He's just asking. So? What you wanna do about that, man? Hmm? Dude, how old are you? Do you think we're still in Form 1? So what? What are you suggesting? I suggest that we meet at the back and settle this. Right. I don't have the mood to play games now. Daryl, please, stop! Nicole. How many times did I tell you to stop telling me what to do? Daryl, head to the counseling office this instant. Class, behave yourself. Hey, don't worry about him, okay? Um, use the guys like that. Huh? You Nicole, okay? are you okay? Nicole, just leave me alone. You came into class and you, you talk how lovely he was. And now what happened? How much do you even know about him? More than you do. Now can you please just leave me alone? 
I thought you'd be there for me. Right now, I'm just trying to help you. But since the first day of college, you've just been focusing on defending your abusive boyfriend. Stop saying that. He's not abusive, Jen. I thought you I thought you would be there for me. But you're just the same as my parents. Chris, Alex, I'd like to have a talk with you. Have a seat. Both of you went to the same school as Nicole and Daryl, right? Okay, what's going on with them? Don't know, don't care. Alex, I don't need that tone from you. Look, could the two of you at least please and try and help them? Ma'am, what else can we do? Daryl, he, he isn't going to take kindly to us sticking our noses in his business. Oh look, the voice of reason. And what's with you, man? You, you used to be good. You know what? I get it. Your friends leave you and you need to be alone. No, you don't get it. I don't need to explain to you what you don't understand. You have to explain it to me. No, I don't. Alex. Ma'am, I'm really sorry about that. It's alright, Chris. You may leave. Alex! 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 Stop! What was that, man? Miss Elena was trying to what help us. What was that? You stop! Don't touch me! Dude! Miss Elena was trying to help us. So? Dude, grow up. Stop blaming everyone around you. I'm not blaming anyone. I moved on. You didn't move on. You act like you're the victim. That's what you did. Alex! I'm not done, Alex! Hello? Dad? Hello, Dad? James, sir. Why didn't you answer my calls? I'm still at school. Never mind. I think you need to put a grab home. I haven't had lunch yet. I'm busy, lah. Find something to eat at home. Okay, Dad. Hi, Dad. James, what are you doing here? I'm waiting for my father. He hasn't come yet? It's so hot here. Have you taken lunch yet? Not yet. You want to go look for something? I can give you a ride. Sure. Come on. Nicole, why haven't you gone home yet? Oh, hi Miss Alina. Just doing some reading. Well, since you're still here, why don't we have a chat? How long have you been with Daryl? Um, since from four. And why do you still bear with his abuse? Look ma'am, it's not like that. Nicole, stop protecting him. I'm not. Why does everybody keep saying that? I just don't want to feel alone. That's absurd, Nicole. You have Jane. No, I don't mean it that way, ma'am. It just feels different, knowing that a guy actually loves me. 
that's what you call love, Nicole? Someone who tells you who you can and can't talk to? Look, I understand if you're feeling lonely, but you're not supposed to be hurt by this. Look, I've lost my son and my husband recently, but do you see me looking for a bad boy just to feel something? You have to be strong and face reality. So, you know him? Yeah, we both knew each other like during secondary school and you know he's been a loner ever since and all the people he thought were his best friends, they all just left him and you know, he's been very lonely ever since. And even people like Daryl and his gang, they all bullied him. And after that, he just blamed everyone around him for his loneliness. They brought me to a psychologist once. It's just so hard um, moving school to school. Everybody thinks that I'm weird, as if I'm special. But you're not. You're not weird. You're just, you know, you're gifted. You must think that. I'm really sorry to burden you. No, no, no. I never think you're weird. If I thought you were weird, then why would I be bothering you right now? Well, everybody says like as if it's so easy. I mean, I, I, I can't just... It's awkward for me to talk to someone. I mean, I understand it's difficult, James, but... You have to try to open up and, you know, talk to someone during your difficult times and you can talk to me I mean I'm here to help okay. it's, it's my mom she have to go now? yeah um, she's outside by the way alright alright Thanks, Chris. Sure. So I'll see you soon. And think about what I said. Right. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay. So, class was terrible today. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Me and Nicole are cute. <laughs> Hold on for a second. Jet, Jet, could, could you please just keep quiet, please? Dad is speaking to someone very important on the phone right now, so I would appreciate it if you just. Yeah. 
Sorry, Mr. Chai, what are you saying? I lost my appetite. It's okay, Sam. You can Ooh. eat it later. Oh, great. I didn't know. Oh, yeah. You guys remember, right? Tomorrow is my therapist appointment. Oh, yeah? I'll give you some money for the grape, okay? No, mom. You have to be there. Including you, Dad. Oh, that will be after tax, right? <laughs> I told him so. Yeah, 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 sure. The doctor says we have to solve this within the family. Oh, yeah. Okay, then, so I'll see you tomorrow at 12 then? Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, alright, right. Perfect. You too, you too. Ooh. Oh, appointment. I can't. I have a meeting tomorrow. You guys never care about me. Excuse me? Who's the one who's paying for the whole hospital bills? And who's always being with you when you're going to the therapist? It's not me. Don't you dare say something stupid like that. What are you doing here? Um, nothing much. I like just trying to get my mind on something. Um, Alex, have you ever been in love? Nah. Didn't need any of the shit that came with it. Can you please just stop? Why are you gonna stop saying that it's their fault that you're alone? Cause it is their fault. Look, ever since form one, I needed them. I needed my friends and they left. And guys like your boyfriend didn't make things any less difficult. Look, Alex, I'm really sorry for that, but I'm pretty sure Daryl didn't mean to. Really, he didn't mean to. You think so? You don't really know that much about Daryl, do you? What do you mean? His dad would always use the bottle he drank out of as a weapon against Daryl. I didn't want to tell anyone because I pitied him back then. Kind of regret it now. But, but then why are you telling me all this now? Want to see what you're going to do about it. Alex, thank you. I won't walk out on you if you let me be your friend. We gotta talk. So, how was the therapy session today, Jen? It was good. And they sounded serious this time. So, how's the thing with you between Daryl? Um, speaking about Daryl, 
I actually broke up with him yesterday, but it's been really difficult, Jen, and you were right about him, and I'm really, really sorry. No worries. You still got me. No more going through this alone. Promise? Promise. So Nicole, how are you and Daryl now? Uh, we actually broke up the other day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I'm really sorry for what he did to you, James. It's okay, Nicole. Alright, and thank you, Chris, for always bringing James around. Sure, around no campus. problem. Hi, guys. Hey, Jen. Hi, Jen. I'm really sorry about everything. Can you forgive me? It's alright. Thank you. And um, you guys are welcome to join and sit with me next time. Sure. And you're welcome to join us at the cafe next time. Alex! I'm gonna kill you, man! Like father, like son. Today? Since your lecturer is not in today, so I'll be sitting in for the day. So let's get started. Thank you. 